loves it, Gareth. <laughs> this is a Umar Ahmed for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. Well, this is a throwback for the IFL viewers. We've got Jamie Cox on, but no longer, of course, as a professional boxer, three years out the ring. But you're doing something else, Jamie. Of course, our viewers won't really know about the bare knuckle scene. Just to tell us a little bit about that scene and why you're doing this. Uh, well, like I stopped the boxing and um, I had a few years out and uh, you don't play boxing. So, uh, you know, I needed a new goal and uh, one of my friends, Jimmy Coyle, he, um, he, he mentioned about the BKFC. Then I got uh, in contact or uh, David, David Feldman contacted me from the BKFC. It's blowing up massive now and uh, I got a bit between my teeth. It's a little bit shorter rounds and um, I thought it's uh, a new goal for me. I'm looking forward to it. I can't wait. And, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to the challenge. Yeah, a little conversation off camera with you and asked you, is this kind of a one-off? Are you doing this for the experience? But you said, no, you want to go all the way in this. So at 35 years old, yeah. right now, even though you look about 25, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, you're determined that a couple of years you want to stay in this sport, Jamie? Yeah, a couple of years, a couple of years. It's a good, because of the format of the sport and how it is, you can get a good few years out of this, you know what I mean? And um, I feel good, the sparring's going good, everything's going good. I had to lose a lot of weight because I put on a lot of weight from um, where I was out, you know, which is, uh, I've lost like three stone already. And um, yeah, I'm ready to go. I feel good in the gym. I listen to my coach. If my, if my coach said I weren't ready, John, John said I weren't ready, then I would. But I'm going to be more than ready for this. Five two minute rounds, ready to blow some jaws off. In your retirement period, did you ever consider coming back to boxing? Uh, that, was, that, that was my passion. Do you know what I mean? And like, you know, I, I was doing things that I shouldn't. And you can't play the sport. It's a lifestyle. It's not just, um, you can't mess about with it. And, uh, but this is my new goal now. BKFC, David Fellman, mate, he's really propelling this sport. It's, it's going to be one of the biggest sports. It's about to blow up massive. And uh, I'm good to be part of it in the UK to blow this up now. Go over there. I want to be over in America and smashing it. Of course, the main difference is that it's bare knuckle compared to your old profession but what are the other differences that you've noticed whilst you've been training and sparring for this well yeah it's, 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 it's obviously boxing without the gloves but there's a, there's a bit more grappling it's a new it's a similar concept but a little bit different and um, you know obviously getting it with a without a glove the glove is is, is going to be a little bit you're going to get more superficial marks than long term damage and um, yeah, that's it, man. Just just ready to land the woofy. That's it. That's what we're looking forward to, you know. So um, yeah, I've had I've had a lot of um, experience in the. Almost probably one of the most experienced in the game for the for the when it comes to the boxing pedigree. Yeah. So um, yeah, I'll, I'll try and use that and put it to the best I can. Sure. Yeah. As your career went on in boxing, the nerves were getting reduced and reduced because you were so experienced that it. Um, Slightly nervous for this because it's a completely different thing that you're going into a different world. Uh, always have some sort of like nerves, but I'm all excited and uh, I'm 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 raring to go for this. I can't wait for it. I'm, you know what I mean? It's it's something that really got me uh, motivated. You know, I was just I, I needed that. So um, yeah, it's got me really motivated again, and I can't wait for it. Listen, Jamie, you look in fantastic shape, and I hope everything goes well with this. I'm sure the boxing fans will be backing you to to like triumph in this sport. Just a, a last one to close off. Do you still keep up with the boxing scene? Yeah, all the all, all the time, all the time. I mean, I've just looking at there with uh, Eddie smashing it with. The, I see the Canelo and Triple G. I'm looking forward to that fight coming up. Big, big fight, and obviously Joshua and Usyk out in Saudi Arabia. Uh, Saudi, right? Is that right? Yeah, yeah. 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 So, um, yeah. who are you picking in that one? Ah uh, man, Joshua's, Joshua's got the power, mate. He's deadly always, but you know, Usyk's the master boxer, so it's. Uh, I, I think Joshua has to go and try and nail him, but um, yeah, it's, 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 it's a good fight, good fight, and I uh, wish Joshua's a great advocate for the sport, but they both are, so um, best of luck to both. Well, listen, best of luck to you, Jamie, and your endeavours in this uh, new venture for yourself. I'm sure we'll have a word on IFL soon, all right, top man? Yeah, thanks very much. Thanks very much. Thanks. Very much. Thank you. Welcome, Team Everlast, to the Team Everlast Fitness Act. Download the Everlast Fitness app and find your greatness within.